just exactly 7.22 on your Friday morning, January the 9th. What is the temperature out there? I think it was about 30 degrees or 28, 28 degrees. Cold enough this morning. And looking for highs in the 30s. Not going to be, uh, don't look for any any really warm weather for the next five to seven days. In fact, uh, frozen precip in the forecast as we get into next week. We've got your forecast at 5 and 35 after the hour every hour all day long here on News Talk 1290. Your next forecast coming up bottom of the hour here on the Rise and Shine Show. Terry McAdams is in the studio with us from Mac Tech Solutions located here in Parker Square. And this morning we're going to talk a little bit about the technology that uh, Terry uses here every Friday morning to record all what we do in the studio here with him on Fridays. Terry um, uh, uses a GoPro camera uh, as well as his iPhone and his Mac and some other devices. So, Terry, let's talk a little bit about the technology involved in doing uh, uh, basically archiving what we do here and making it available for, uh, uh, you know, viewing on the Internet later on. Well, um what we have here is, of course, as uh, Mike mentioned, uh, we have a, a GoPro camera. And, um, of course, on when you see this on the video, you're going to see us looking at the camera. And, and I'm going to show you the different devices that way. So this will give you a reason to go out there and look. Bye, <laughs> um, Bye. So what we have here is we have my iPhone um, loaded up with an app that GoPro has that lets me connect to my camera via Wi-Fi. The camera makes its own little Wi-Fi hotspot, a little private one. And so this is what you could take with you while you're out in the field. Um, you can mount this camera. Let's say you're going hunting, and you want to take that with you. Uh, you can mount the camera on the outside. They've got magnetic mounts. they got all kinds of mounts. And, again, Eddie Hills has all of this. Um, but in any case, you go out and... Um, you uh, mount that up and you take your iPhone into the cab of the truck or whatever you're driving in and you can control the camera. So you can turn it on, turn it off, take snapshots, um, you know, change the mode, put it to sleep, you know, so you don't waste the battery, all kinds of different things. So what we're doing here is, is I'm using it, um, the camera app to control the camera to turn it on just before we go on the air so that we have enough lead time and I can edit it later. Um, and then I've just controlled the camera turning it on, turning it off, and everything just with this. So as you can see, you'll see our picture um, pointing at the camera here, showing the uh, app. And um, so we are uh, on the video here. Right. So that's the first thing. Right. Now, the audio side of it, you actually uh, take audio off of our uh, headphone amplifier over here. What are you capturing the audio with there? That's oh. an interesting little digital recorder you got there. Right. It's called a Zoom H4n as a model. Um, it actually has two channels in it, so we can capture two at a time. And so it's a, it's it's on the professional side. It's only about 200 bucks though. And they have a single channel version that's about $100 called an H1. Um, but it's got an external microphone, which I'll never use. Uh, it's too much noise. It picks up everything. Right. Um, but, yeah, it's a, it's a professional level type recorder. But uh, I take all of this into my Mac into iMovie and edit it all together. So I take the sound and I synchronize it. It's pretty easy to do because, if again, if you ever want to know how to do that, let us know. But uh, I take all that in there and I edit it, uh, take out, because I have done some full programs here lately uh, during the holidays and things, and so I've been, had a lot of practice. So I take all this and then I end up, end up uh, uploading it to YouTube. And you use the Mac for that purpose. Now, the uh, of course, there's all kinds of editing software out there for PCs and Macs that you can use this with. I think Movie Maker is the one that, that Windows has on it. But the one for the Mac, uh, based on what you've described to me, seems to be the most seamless one out there. Oh, yeah. I mean, it, it, Apple, of course, in the business of making it easy. Um, but I may upgrade to um, the uh, Adobe Premiere Elements. They have a home or, or a, uh, not a professional but a home user type of uh, program that's a little bit easier to use because i'm not a professional at this but anyway so yeah so you have premiere and then of course on uh, the windows side that's also available uh, movie maker i don't have any experience with that but i don't know if it's good or not i don't hear a lot of people using it it's mostly premiere um so uh but yeah it, it's all kind of cool you can get it together of course you know a movie editing program is not just for taking videos i mean you can take slides photos and actually put things together and uh, make slideshows and things so it's kind of cool but putting music and all that together 
Well, of course, if people want to find out more about anything to do with the Max or, or what you do here, I mean, you, you'll be glad to talk to them. And, of course, Mac Tech Solutions here in Parker Square, uh, you, you do sell all the Mac products, the iPads, uh, MacBook Pro, everything, all the accessories, and you also service the iPhone. Now, you don't sell the iPhone, but you do service the iPhone, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. So you have any warranty, out of warranty, any issue at all with an iPhone, you can bring it in, and, and we can give you some guidance on what to do. If it's under warranty and there's an issue that, that's covered, then we certainly can get that exchanged for you. Sometimes we can do the same-day repair. Uh, in many cases, it's just a, the next-day replacement. So, what's the, most, what's the most common iPhone issue you see? Crack screens. Yep. I figured that would be the case because I see so many people walk around and they put it in their back pocket. I watch them stuff in their pocket and I go, okay, you're going to sit on this thing and destroy this phone. <laughs> well, actually, it doesn't seem to be that when it's in their back pocket that they crack the screens because it's pretty, tra- yeah, it's, it's, it's a drop or a direct hit or, of course, they go swimming sometimes into the toilet, things like that. So, you know, but hey, this stuff doesn't like water for sure very first pager i ever owned in my life this is a long time ago 25 years ago and i had a pager i carried with me and got in the shower and sat it up on the shelf above the toilet and the seat was up on the toilet guess what happens pager goes off while i'm in the shower and just vibrates itself right down into the toilet you know and back in those days a pager was a couple hundred dollars i mean they weren't they weren't cheap then you know of course it's not like buying a new iphone now which is you know if you buy one outright what's well, about 600 bucks isn't it yeah, at, at least so yeah so was that when you're in your drug running days for your okay <laughs> yeah yeah back in my other life when i was making money <laughs> <laughs> yeah drug running days mac tech solutions here in parker square you guys are open uh what monday through saturday now correct yes uh, monday through friday is 10 to 6 and saturdays 10 to 4 and of course we're closed on sundays but uh, we're there whenever you know you need us and of course we go on site too so don't think you have to come in the store you can call us and we can come on site yeah. tell them how to uh, get in touch with you. uh just call 767-6227 or just come on into the store of course in parker square um facebook is just search uh, mac tech solutions apple specialist Terry, thanks very much for coming in today. Coming up 7.30 in the morning here on News Talk 1290 and Newstalk1290.com. Also, if you've got an iPhone or if you've got an Android phone, you can take us with you on your mobile device with the Radio Pup mobile app. You can download that for free at Newstalk1290.com. It's also available in the App Store on your device. Again, it's a totally free download, and you can stream all the great Town Square media stations directly to your phone wherever you go. Your news word of the day coming up, news and weather from KAUZ and the Rush Update on the way next on News Talk 1290.